The Adopt a Village Boyiga Island project is one of the five year projects implemented by our club and Buyiga Island is located in Kamengo Sub County, PG District or Lake Victoria. This island has a population of about 20,000 people who survive mainly on fishing and subsistence agriculture. The only mean to this island is by use of canoes and the only mean of transport on the island is by border border. The island is only blessed with only one health center too that is not well stocked with medical equipment. This island still has only one government aided primary school and one government aided secondary school that only accommodates up to the ordinary level that is senior four. The island does not have any other mean of skills development, any other chance of skills development. So the girls and boys only stop at senior four for as long as they cannot accommodate receiving education from outside this island. This has caused many young girls to drop out of school, bringing about early marriages. Previously, the residents of this island could only have a chance to take water from the nearby swamps. This water was so muddy that could bring a lot of illnesses like bilharzia and typhoid. Amazigaliga <laughs> To date, on the matter of water, we've been able to successfully gain funding for six boreholes rotating all the six major villages on the island. And to date, the four have been launched and they are fully operational. As president of the Water Club of Lubaka Lake View today, I am excited. We are in Muga Island. Today we are commissioning two more wells to be Aga Island here. We have, uh, today we are also giving out sanitary towels to a number of to 200 uh, school girls. We are excited that we have achieved this in the current total year and we, we look forward to working with our friends, our Ferretarians in Sweden next lottery year come July. We are excited and we encourage members, committee members in Biga here to collect money which they will use to sustain these wells. So far there are four wells and we are bringing two more. Thank Hello, you. my name is Christian Ranklu. I am from Sweden. I am from Help at Hand, an organization in Sweden helping people in uh, Africa, and especially Uganda, but also in the Philippines, in Asia. I'm here now at Buyiga Island, uh, a small island in a swamp area in Uganda. Together with uh, this club, Rotary Club of Rubaga Lake View, we are uh, giving um, six boreholes to the people on the island of Buyiga. Buyiga has about 19,000 people, 19,000 people, who, and they never had really clean water in this island before. Many are sick and uh, they have no, so far had no access to clean water. Uh, next to me here on my left side is there is a hospital. In the hospital they have no teachers, they have no clean water, they have no access to medicine, anything. Just because of the lack of water in the island, we also have problems to attract doctors and nurses to the hospital. In front of me uh, we have a, a school which also had the same problem. The students are there and they want to go to school, but the teachers they don't want to work here because there's no access to clean water. We have been carrying out a number of medical camps 
on this island every year to majorly treat malaria, typhoid, HIV, AIDS, sickle cell screening, and other family planning methodologies. We were also blessed on one of these visits to the island with the presence of our dear honorary member, Princess Joan Nasolo, who happily donated two wheelchairs to two vulnerable children to aid their movement, especially to school. And this was through her Joan Nasolo Foundation. We are forever grateful. Hi, my name is Princess Joan Nasolo. Um, and I'm here as an honorary member of the Rotary Club, Rubaga Lake View. Um, I'm excited to be here on Buiga Island. It's my first time and I'm excited to see all the work that the Rotary has done. I'm excited to see all the different boreholes and as a foundation we delivered um, some wheelchairs to donate to the island as well. So I'm excited to see such a beautiful island. I never knew it existed and it was my first time taking a board as well. But uh, I'm excited to be here and see all the work that's being done and I look forward to coming back and partnering with Rotary Club Lakeview again. Thank you. We are so appreciative to all the water management committees of these villages that have done a great work in mobilizing the resources locally. For example, the bricks and sand. You know, whenever we go to Uyga Island, we normally spend the night, but we enjoy as a family and we are always welcomed as members of this community. We always feel at home whenever we are in Uyga. Thank you so much for this happiness that we always share as a team and it is always staying with us to always see how best can we add to what we've done in the past. We have a number of partners in this water project. For this year 2021-2022, our emphasis is mainly going to be on education and economic empowerment. We want to see how best can we transform the economic aspect of the residents of Uyiga. We have a program that we have stipulated and for the school we are looking forward to constructing more classroom blocks at both the primary and the secondary school. We hereby call for your intervention, dear Rotarians and guests. We have a plan for this and we will be obliged if you come to our rescue. God bless you.